With around 2 billion gamers all over the world, it's safe to say that video games are a pretty successful form of entertainment. While we might assume most of the gamers are young men, don't let this fool you. The realm of gamers is filled with unusual players who stand out for any number of reasons. Whether it be age, disability, or even species, these players don't usually come to mind when we think of typical gamers. Victor de Leon III Think back a decade. Were you getting spawn killed or teabagged constantly by a player named Lil Poison? Don't feel too bad, we bet this happened to a lot of people. You see, Lil Poison's actual name is Victor de Leon III and he is the youngest professional gamer on record. In 2000, at the age of just two, he was playing NBA 2K. At around the age of four, when most of us were still trying to color within the lines, he was competing in major Halo competitions and even finished second second amongst 500 other players. Rustam Ishkildin Marathon gaming sessions usually span a day or two but almost always end because people need to get out and interact with society. In 2015, Russian teenager Rustamish Kildin broke his leg and like most teens, filled his time with some gaming. Did we say some? We meant a ridiculous amount. In fact, for 22 days straight, it's all he did. Taking only small breaks to nap and eat, the 17-year-old's lack of physical activity caught up with him and he died from a severe case of thrombosis. Ben Breen One seemingly critical ability a gamer needs is sight, but Ben Breen proves this isn't the case. What makes this gamer unusual is that he is blind. Unable to see since birth, that hasn't stopped Breen from gaming. In fact, he's a lot better than you'd think and can even beat his friends on a regular basis. Not distracted by the graphics, he uses sound as the cue to make a move in such games as Mortal Kombat and Rock Band. Georgi LeVay Imagine being an avid gamer and one day losing both your hands. That is exactly what happened to Georgi when he suffered a severe meningitis infection. With no hands, LaVey looked to adapt and find a solution to his challenge. He and other engineers at Johns Hopkins University developed controllers that are operated with the feet. The sandal-like controllers have allowed him to play games like Fallout 4 and World of Warcraft on par with players who still have the use of their hands. Virtual Parents These gamers are not only unusual, but incredibly disturbing. Much of gaming is about entering an alternate world or living a virtual life. In 2010, an unnamed Korean couple decided to play out a virtual life which included raising a virtual child. There was just one huge problem. The couple had a real-life baby which they forgot all about. The infant ended up dying from malnutrition because the couple were so focused on caring for their virtual family. Needless to say, both were arrested as a result. Doreen Fox Grandmothers are supposed to make cookies, play card games, and spoil the grandkids. Not snipe, camp, and spawn kill. However, Doreen Fox can't get enough Call of Duty. In her late 70s, Fox got hooked on the shooter game and even lines up outside the store to pick up the newest releases when they come out. The British grandma says she likes the action and violence, which probably explains why she also loves Grand Theft Auto. Kathleen Connell Since we're on the topic of older gamers, how about we move on to one of the oldest gamers ever? When Kathleen Connell was born, the first traffic light had just been invented and the world was still two years away from the outbreak of the First World War. Nonetheless, a century on, she can be found with her Nintendo DS Lite and a handful of games which she uses to keep her brain sharp as a tack. Holding the record for the oldest Nintendo player, what's amazing is that this Scottish granny didn't start gaming until she was 96. Cats and Dogs who knew that in addition to being great pets, cats and dogs can also make decent gamers? Don't believe us? Just take a look around the internet. Alright, while well, you're not likely to get defeated playing Halo or Call of Duty by one of your furry friends, there is more than enough evidence to show that some animals love to game. From Fruit Ninja to Virtual Soccer, they may not quite get the concept, but it doesn't stop them from trying. 
world leaders. Political leaders of various countries are some of the most powerful people in the world, but at the 2014 Nuclear Security Summit, world leaders got together and one of the things they did was game. The computer game was dubbed Nukes on the Loose and tested the various leaders' responses and actions in relation to a simulated nuclear threat. Okay, so it wasn't a mainstream game, but we're still searching for footage of Obama and Merkel playing League of Legends. Tio Trio. This 11-year-old boy is not unlike other kids his age in that he loves video games. But what is amazing is that Trio has no arms or legs. Born without limbs, he has adapted to life remarkably well. Utilizing his chin and shoulders to operate his PlayStation controller, this Indonesian gamer has demonstrated time and time again that he has no trouble keeping up with his able-bodied friends. We hope you enjoyed this video. Are you a gamer? Leave your comments down below and don't forget to subscribe to The Richest for more amazing videos daily. Thanks for watching.